Hello, and welcome to your Empath Energy Update for the week of April 27th. And it's all about the crown. Now, what are we talking about? Let's get to it. Welcome everyone to this week's Empath Energy Update. And yes, it's all about the crown. Now, are we talking about your crown or your crown chakra? What exactly are we referencing here? Hello everyone, my name's Christine. I'm with 24 Karat Healing and I'm your spiritual medium, intuitive energy coach and old soul healer. And this week is interesting because uh, last week was about the angel of balance, uh, the angel of strength, and then you had a lot of heart healing. Um, if you do recall last week's message, if not, go back and have a look. But, um, you know, and that, then the song Give It Away came up as well. And uh, this time, um, there was no music, uh, there was no song, it was more reference to, um, <laughs> because, you know, we're, we're talking about Corona, right, and we're not talking about the beer, but um, it's also Latin for crown. Isn't that interesting? So, you know, when I see, you know, I see visual of the crown, are you, what parts of you are the king? What parts of you are the queen? Um, what parts are, you know, your seventh chakra? Um, are you seeing a lot of purple, very, very light iridescent purple? Are you seeing uh, a lot of white? Um, this is, you know, your dreams are very vivid right now as well. And sometimes it might be even on uh, borderline nightmares as well or if that's what it feels like that's because your your soul is waking up you're waking up we're all waking up and this is for you to pay attention and please write down your dreams and if you say you can't remember them that's fine that's fine it takes practice you it takes patience you can ask your guides angels and loved ones to come in uh, to assist you. I mean, you have to ask if you want this information to come in. And many times it's not, you're not ready for those messages as well. Maybe that's why you're not remembering them. Um, so, and they're hidden as well. So they're, they're from your soul. This is Akashic stuff. This is ancestral stuff. Um, your guides, your angels, your loved ones. And, you know, Again, not ready to receive. Be patient. Wait. You inherently know at a deep soul level what is happening. It's happening for us, not to us. <sighs> um, and like I said, there, there is no, I keep hearing normal. There is no normal. Was normal really working for us? I mean, are you going to... I'd love someone to tell me that normal is how they want to go back. Do you, do you want to go back that, to what it was? I know I don't. I'm really enjoying this time of reflection, inner healing, breathing, pausing, meandering. Um, yeah, and then I hear, you know, finances. What about our money? And what about our homes? What about our family? What about our our savings, you know, our retirement. Yes, I, I, we understand. We have been too tight deeply to ego, ego pursuits, ego, ego, ego. Um, basically, it's edging God out. And this is all about Christ consciousness, galactic energy, universe, activations, healing. We are all here for love and forgiveness. That's it. Okay. So you've got to change your mindset. You are not your thoughts. And as Wayne Dyer would say, have a mind that's open to everything and attached to nothing. 
Uh, we also have Pluto retrogrades. It is Taurus season as well. We're coming into May. Uh, there, you know, this, this Pluto retrograde, April 25th to October 4th, healing, transformations, working on it all. The truth will be revealed. Absolutely. All right, let's uh, get into the cards here. And of course, uh, using the Energy Oracle deck by Sandra Ann Taylor. It's a beautiful deck. It's my favorite. <laughs> and I did pull a, we pulled a card from the self-care deck as well. Uh, it was nature for last week. So I'm curious to see what is coming up. And you know what? They're keeping it simple this week. Um, more simplicity. That's what I keep hearing. Keep it simple. You know, as the teacher used to say, keep it simple, sweetheart. <laughs> okay. Um, Angel of Balance is coming out yet again. And this is interesting because all last week I seen rainbows, rainbows everywhere, rainbows on my wall, um, rainbows at the grocery store, like our local grocery store. Um, his, the owner's daughter actually had drew a rainbow and said, we all believe in you. We will get through this. And they made them into their divider boards at each checkout. They made them into signs. There's rainbows all over um, the windows. I, I've just been seeing rainbows everywhere. And if you look at this, there is that elixir. You've got your angels. You've got the wings. You've got the elixir. You've got the pyramids. We are still in this new moon energy as well. Gold energy. It's all about balance and calling in and being present and being calm and detachment. Don't be attached to things. Um, and we are all being tested. Yes, your family, your friends, your co-workers, your job, whatever it is. You get to choose. Choose. Choose again. Choose wisely. <laughs> you are wiser than you know. And then I just, you know, I'm hearing owls as well. So look to owls. There's a lot of wisdom. And they look at everything, the whole 300. They could turn their head, right, all the way around, just like we can. We have to stop and look at the big picture. And, yeah, that crown energy. We are anchored in the light, in that Christ consciousness. We are. I am. That's all we need. All right, so I've got the angel of balance. And... You know what? <laughs> Self-care deck coming in. As you can see, that was last week's card, Nature. Uh, you got the ring there. So one card from the energy deck and one card. Two. I'm hearing two. Okay, two. First one is rest. Rest. Rest and relax. Release guilt and make your needs a top priority. So we're going back to self-care again. Oh, and look at the, the pillows. Do you see the, the new moon energy in there? Do you see the moon? Do you see the beautiful flowers? Uh, they, I want to say tulip, but I want it looks more lotus energy. Um, resting, relaxing, just being present in everything. All right, so the angel of balance wants us to rest and relax and reflect. Dreams. <laughs> dreams, yes, all about the dreams. You've got the Akashic Records. See the hand, that, that's the hand. That's the hand of everything that's available to you. Rest, think big. There are unseen forces ready to support your dreams. What are your dreams about? What are your dreams about? What what do you dream of? A new earth? 5D love? Unconditional love? Let me know in the comments below, guys. And if you're watching the replay, comment replay. And if you have any questions, reach out. Um, and yes, of course, this was recorded earlier. So please ask a question or comment if any of these messages resonate, if you're looking for more guidance. Um, as well, uh, I have 
I have, sorry, <laughs> I have a beautiful, intuitive uh, soul channeling. And yes, we are all able to channel from our higher power. It's our inner soul knowings. It's already there. And I have a webinar coming up this Thursday, April 30th at 6 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. So if you're interested, please comment channeling or webinar channeling webinar whatever yeah and it's complimentary and we're meeting uh via zoom and it's going to be intimate and recorded so you can watch it again and i will email you all the details or you can send me an email 24k healing at gmail.com as well Yes, so I have that and uh, YouTube, uh, still looking for my 100th subscriber. And once we hit 100, uh, that person within the group gets a special gift from myself. So if you're not subscribed, please subscribe below and follow along as well. And yeah, so I mean, the messages are pretty beautiful. They're pretty profound. Um, I know a lot of us still have a lot of questions and, you know, when is this going to, you know, when can we go back to everything? Well, not until we learn our lessons and there's many lessons, including for myself. So, um, and not, you're not being punished for anything. In fact, this is a great time. I mean, the earth is getting to breathe. The animals are like, thank you. The flowers, everything is blooming. And so are we, it is all a process and we have to trust the process. So are you ready to trust? <laughs> All right. I also want to uh, let you know um, every Wednesday, uh, the Power of Healing Your Energy show, 4 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. So follow along on Facebook or YouTube. Uh, and don't miss, uh, I've got an interesting uh, gentleman coming uh, out of Toronto, Ontario, Canada. And um, he's all about energy healing and actually works with the brain. Uh, so it's going to be an interesting conversation about that as well. I just, you know, if you would like to sign up and receive a complimentary chakra, it's all about the chakras. And it's interesting that I have the crown chakra here, but uh, from the root to the crown, I have tips, ideas, mantras, how to work with that energy, how to remove any blocks or gaps in the energy. So if you'd like that, please comment chakras and I will get you a link to the newsletter. You've got to sign up for that uh, to my monthly newsletter. And then you also receive $20 off your first reading or healing or both. <laughs> All right, guys. And uh, yeah, this is the intuitive soul channeling that is coming up this Thursday, April 30th, 6 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. I want to wish you guys love, light, and blessings. And as well, if you have any questions, please reach out. And I also have another uh, group in Facebook called Heal Healing Begins Where the Ego Ends. And that's where I'm going to leave you guys. Love, light, and blessings. Take care, everyone, and have an amazing week.